Hey coders and welcome to the 10th episode of our spreadsheet service playlist on the Google Apps Script course. In this video we're going to be talking about formatting cells. So there are plenty ways to format cells in a spreadsheet. I've listed out the top 8 in my opinion and they are set background, set font color, set font weight, set font style, set font line, set font family, set font size, and set border. So 7 out of the 8 of these have a plural method as well. So if you wanted to set the formatting of multiple cells within a range, you could also do that. We're only going to look at the singular method, the singular form of the method in the code. So let's take a look at the code right now. I'm here in App Script, and we are now getting a sheet called Formatting Demo. Let me show you that in the spreadsheet. Here it is. And I have data in, col in columns A1, or column A through column H. And basically my plan is just to change the formatting of each of these cells using App Script. So I've gone in and I've written all of the methods from the slides down because I didn't want to just waste time typing in letters and stuff like that. So all of these methods are methods of the class range. So I've gotten the ranges from A1 to H1. And let me just go through these methods again very quickly. So set background takes an argument. You can either write the color of the background in plain English or you can write a hexadecimal interpretation of the color and same with same, same with set font color this can be hexadecimal or it can be a in plain English set font weight it either takes bold or normal as its argument set font style is italic or normal font line is underline it can also be strike through so or actually not strike through it can be line through which in plain English means strike through so the line through the words if you know what I'm talking about there font family that's basically the font that you're using I'm going to select impact font size is font size and I'm going to change that from 10 I believe I believe it's at 10 yep it's at 10 right now and I'm going to change it to 24 and then set border. So set border has a lot of arguments. So let me just show you. Let me just type in set border. And as you can see, a lot of these arguments are booleans. So say you want to set border. So the top border. And if you want that to be uh, present, then you'll type in true. I don't see here. So I will, I'll type in false for that. But it goes top, left, bottom, right. And then booleans are vertical and horizontal. So if I'm say, right here, I'm typing in null, that means just leave it as is. I don't want it to be either true or false, just leave it as is, whatever it is right, right currently. So the next one is color. So again, I'll just type in blue for now. And border style. So border style is a enum of the spreadsheet app. So let me let's just see the options that you have. You have solid, double, dash, dotted, and then solid medium, solid thick. So I'm just going to say dotted for now, and I'm also going to get rid of this. There we go. Okay, so we're going to save, and we're going to run, and no errors. That's that's good. All right, so each of these cells now are formatted according to our rules that we had in the code. So here's our blue border. Here's the big font size. Here it's an impact. So before I close out this video, I want to show one more method actually because I would feel remiss if I didn't. So you can also say if you if you like RGB values, right? So if you want to set a color and, and set it with an RGB value, you can say set background RGB. So this takes in the red, the green, and the blue values. So let's just say give it a little bit of green and a little bit of blue and let me just comment this out so if we save it and run it again now our A1 should have a different color and it's a bluish color and that's it yeah so guys I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you learned a lot don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one